This is Pepper. My name is Pepper and I'm a humanoid robot. Now she may look like just a toy, one step up from those mechanical pets made for kids, but in fact she's the most sophisticated artificially intelligent thinking machine ever made. And she's already shaking up a handful of industries that are embracing AI and robotics, like banking, retail, and even healthcare. You see, her creators have big plans for Pepper. What we're realizing is this device, this tool, this robot, is a way for us to bridge that divide between the digital world and the physical world that hasn't really ever existed before. What is happening for businesses, specifically in retail and retail banking, is they know that their customers are going to have a higher level of customer satisfaction when they interact with both of those platforms. So what we're doing with the robot is ensuring that there's an interaction with both of those platforms, whether you're in the physical space or the digital space. You're now going to be across all of them. We caught up with Pepper at her new home at the HSBC Bank in Miami, where she made her splashy debut this week as part of the 2019 FinTech Americas Conference. Hello, Pepper. How are you today? I'm always feeling good. Thank you. How are you? <laughs> I'm well. Thank you very much. Why don't you tell us a little, tell us about yourself. And let me just say, interviewing a robot, that was a first for me. It was one of the most interesting, challenging interviews I've ever done. Tell me about your family. The awesome HSBC team is my family. What can I help you with? You can choose one of the options on the screen. So here would give me the choices about whether opening a bank account, a credit card, or asking something else. Now for companies like HSBC, there's a tangible bottom line benefit to having a robot meet, greet, and interact with customers. Pepper brings an amazing uh, cutting edge innovation, uh, retail banking customer experience in a way that we don't see other competitors realizing that we live in an experiential world and consumer banking for the most part is transactional. So the question is how can you take a transactional uh, environment into an experience which is fun. The better the experience, the more engaged the experience, in some cases the more digital the experience, even if it's a physical experience, leads to a deeper uh, relationship with your customer, a more long-term value with the customer, a more meaningful value to the customer, and actually a deeper uh, financial relationship with the customer. So I think it's fair to say that what we're seeing here is truly a glimpse of the future. We don't think of the future of banking or the bank of the future. We live and breathe it every day. Can you dance for me? Yay! Let's dance. Take it away. Until next week, I'm Nick Tate bringing you this Bold Profits update, and for the latest on AI, technology, and robotics, and the investment opportunities they provide, you can find me at banyanhill.com or email me at boldprofits at banyanhill.com. Thanks for joining me today.